Hey everyone, Haas GNAT News. Today we're at the Bennington Airport and we're going to be checking out a new program that's just only a few months old. It's a cadet program with the Civil Air Patrol. Forward of the firewall, from the firewall to the aft bulkhead, which is just behind that rear window. That section leading back to the tail and the tail itself. What section is, what is this called? This I'm Deputy Commander for Cadets Hal Friday of the Bennington Composite Squadron of the Civil Air Patrol. We run a cadet program here, and the purpose of the cadet program is really to develop America's future aviation and aerospace leaders. We do that in a whole bunch of ways. We do leadership training, aerospace education, search and rescue training, and, and first aid training, all kinds of really great stuff. I'm Cadet Airman First Class Aiden Merchandani. Uh, I joined the Civil Air Patrol and I stayed in the Civil Air Patrol because the end goal for me is really to join the Air Force or the Navy and to fly the big fighter jets. Different people need to be led by different kinds of leaders too, right? Um, if I were a go, go, go in your face kind of leader, that might really work for Bashir, right? That might really motivate him. That might make Robinson just go like, oh no, no way man, I'm out of here, forget about this, CAP is not for me, right? And so different What to me makes the Civil Air Patrol a little bit more interesting than some of the other uniformed youth uh, organizations is that we have that emergency services real world mission all the time. If the Air Force Rescue Coordination Center called, uh, called up the line tomorrow, we would be taking the qualified cadets up into the mountains with us and looking in that search and rescue mission for the people who are up there who are needing a rescue. Um, and so that's something that you don't see in other organizations, youth being able to do. My father used to do the Civil Air Patrol, but um, he's since passed, so I thought it'd be an interesting way to like honor his memory and do something that he would have been really proud of me for doing and something he would want me to do. And so I, I went to the first meeting and I was like, this is, looks really interesting, looks really fun. Like, I, I understood why my dad wanted to do it. Right. Bushy. Button center. Bushy, all in this meeting, starting on the 6th of August, you'll be taking over as element leader. Yes, sir. For the very beginning, saying sir was uh, was difficult. <laughs> um, I would often get it uh, mixed up in certain different ways. Um, uh, having, there's a, in the Civil Air there's a, a lot of learning to do, and keeping up with it is, uh, it can be very fast paced, but I, it's it's manageable to what it is so far. Uh, but I love it. Challenges can be overcome, and that's what I've done so far. Well, you know, for me, what I'm really looking for is developing leadership, developing character, uh, developing young men and women. I'm not interested necessarily in developing military leadership. I'm not necessarily interested in developing aerospace leadership. I want to develop young men and women who can go out there in the world and do good things. Uh, and I think that the Civil Air Patrol Cadet Program can provide a way for them to do that.